um, ships to to fight them. Yep. And they are known for taking over like small islands and stuff. Yep. And they are basically ruthless. sort of like roving pirates and stuff. Yes. Yep. Okay. Cool. It's possible that some might still be here. I imagine that the Sahag would have probably been trading with them based off these... Tra- uh, well, either trading or maybe they attacked one of their- attacked one of their vessels. I don't think they're that impractical. But who knows. I guess we'll find out. Are they just, uh, like, normal shields? Like, any shield? Just normal, basic shields. I'm actually going to pick one up. I... One. Yep. Mm-hmm. All I'm saying is carrying that shield openly in Salt Marsh. Um, might Probably not cause, the best idea. Might cause people to be cross at you. Glorious. <laughs> like, I'm not saying that the guards will arrest you or anything, because, you know, you've not done anything illegal, but there's a good chance that people will not be happy. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Alright. <clears throat> well, I suppose from here, the only ways down. Yes, I think that's all we have left, right? Do you think this was the actual room that Elmo wanted us to find, though? I suspect so. Why would he want us to find that? Well, we can always go and ask him. Can I investigate the secret room for secret rooms? (laughs) <laughs> you can investigate the secret room for secret rooms, and you also realize that the other two walked out without looking at the coffer. Oh, I want that coffer straight away. <laughs> well, right. that, that was for me, just like uh, my need to fiddle with things, so I've just been <laughs> pressing buttons on the keyboard. <laughs> fair enough, fair enough. Mm-hmm. <laughs> uh, Stolga, give me an investigation check. Also, give me an intelligence check. I'd rather not. Come on, it can't be worse than what Shadows rolled. Alright, yeah, all good. Uh, You do not find any more secret rooms in the secret room. Uh, Also, the coffer contains 12 potions of water breathing. Hmm, very nice. I feel like this is setting up for a nightmare, but that's fine. It I is going to be a nightmare, Shulgit, yes. It's fine. It's fine. <laughs> How long did they last for? Uh, an hour, I believe, but I will look it up. I'm pretty sure it's an hour. You might want to split those up between you two. Mm. Just I assume that cloak will uh, take care of you. Sure will. Uh, I might like flip the hood on. <laughs> 24 <laughs> hours. Straight oh, up. okay. So it lasts a good while. Yep. Damn. Good. <laughs> hey, we can sell the rest. Hump myself with some lay on hands, I think. Because apparently we're going to be here for a little while. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, you can leave at any point. No, we have missions. I don't think we've gotten sufficient information to the Queen. Yeah, we don't know numbers and stuff. We have managed to release a lot of slaves, but... Yeah, which is good. Slaves and the fact that they're starting to reconstruct the whole bloody place, but that's not enough. Mm. Not enough to win a war. Um, you look down and you see... um, Janice would have noticed this earlier when... I mean, all of you would have seen this. Uh, The... Almost... All of the stairs um, are underwater. 
there's water reaching up to like the fourth step. Everything below it is completely submerged in very cool ocean water. I might go to Elmo. Alright. Uh, see how he is doing. Alright. I will... And I will show him the, the armor. And I just want to check. I think we found the room you spoke of. Ah, uh, yes. We got... We got the armor when when we were hired. Use it. R run away. So many, so many teeth. All the teeth. Thank you. When when we're done investigating here, we will see what we can do for you. Don't investigate. Run. Run from the teeth. Teeth? They killed all of That's them. For... They killed all of them. All the slaves for the teeth. What so teeth? many teeth. Big. Huge. So and he, like, just... or something else? He just starts to shake and basically starts to repeat it. Just huge teeth. I don't think he's referring to Sahagwan. I hope he's not referring to what I think he's referring to. Because <laughs> I may you have an idea. You are fairly certain that he is referring to what you're <laughs> afraid. He's and referring. if that is the case, then this won't go well for Paladin. Neither you, you or I or Stolgig or Litrix together can deal with this. Kraken? Kraken. Well, let's go down Keep and Kraken. confirm. Confirm right. and flee very quickly. Let's hope that is the we case. We need to at least... <laughs> I mean, Krakens are pretty big. They probably wouldn't fit in here, right? It's a world with magic, Scar. <laughs> yes, Scar. <laughs> the DM decides if it fits, doesn't it? <laughs> Literally in a fucking house surrounded by the ocean. I think it's gonna fit. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. So I guess we'll go to the stairs that are covered in water and uh right. descend I'm gonna put my all of on you pinned her off <laughs> chug a potion I don't need to who cool for potions uh Litrix will need a potion though because while he can hold his breath probably not long enough okay um let me just get you all on the next layer. It's not that I didn't believe you guys would get there in the first place. I was just waiting with that. Mm -hmm. uh, and Janice. There go. And then move you all down. Oh. Glorious. Now, why it do is, you not black. have vision? That's ominous. <laughs> Kraken, is that you? <laughs> you take the walls. Kraken, Lara. You surround us in walls, and now you surround us by darkness. Why she do you not fight. have? We walked into the mouth of the Kraken. Didn't even know. <laughs> All right, I'm sorry. Token vision is enabled. Night vision is enabled. Why can you not see? Daylight mode? I... Roll 20! I will have words with you and they won't be kind. I'm just gonna refresh just in case. Ah! Oh, oh, I can see everything though. Oh, for fuck's sake. 
Why? I can see, but my vision's limited. I can't see anything. Wait, you can... What? My vision's limited to what it should be. <laughs> my vision Wait. was not limited to what it should be. How is yours not limited? Was... What? That makes no sense. And Janice can't see at all. I mean, I can't see at all now. I tested this. I... I swear I tested this. Oh, there we go. How are we looking now? Oh, there yeah, we go. That. Can yeah. people see and is it everything that you can see? Yep. No, it looks fine. like I am seeing what I'm supposed to see now. Mm -hmm. Okay. Is it a single room? It's a single room with three cars. Yes. Yeah. Okay. I don't know why you could see everything when there was straight up no way for you to... Thank you. Oh, okay. it's fixed now. <laughs> well, you know, now at least you might have a voice of caution in your party. <laughs> yeah. Alright, you swim down, you dive down, you find yourself in a large open area, stone pillars rise from floor to ceiling, and uh, you see three corridors heading off in various directions. Alright, same as earlier. Everyone and... sped up, Litrix, you come with me. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna uh, tell you right now, be careful, alright? She's gonna kill us. Yes. If we step wrong, she'll do it. I will. I know you. I can tell. Hmm. Hmm. Litrix, I mean, we can't even talk underwater, can we? But we can you breathe can underwater, breathe. so does you that mean talk. we can? The potions of water breathing allow you to do this. Oh, okay. Is movement different underwater? It is. You're swimming. But for Up all intents... speed, then? Nah, for all intents uh, and purposes, it is as if you were in the air because of magic. Right. But you can be very easily on top of each other. Yep. That isn't the problem. I would just ask that you don't, because it's a pain in the ass to keep track of. <laughs> <laughs> Litrix, is this all familiar to you? He shakes his head. And he says, it looks completely different than what it used to be. Right, well, I guess we're going in blind. None of well, this is familiar. I can't believe go. they flooded it. Oh. To the north? To the north. Winter is coming. All right. and as carefully and as quietly as we can. In can I just check, is there anything in the room that tells us like which way any of these places go? The, the, what are they called? A sign? Sequaha <laughs> might use. The hug one. Um, it's a hug like one. A map. <laughs> a a map. map. <laughs> um, there is no map. Um, but there is a a sign um above the doorway of of this corridor. Does the sign? Well, I guess the sign's in the hug one, isn't it? Yup. <laughs> oh, <dear. laughs> Does it look like it's a dangerous sign, or is it like <laughs> this all this way? I'm gonna roll insight to see if I get a feeling <laughs> as to what it might say. Impending doom awaits. Um, it's a relatively angry-looking sign. The sign itself, or what or is on the sign? <laughs> Both. We were looking for angry things, shall we? And teeth. This is the angry direction, you guys. Are you sure? <laughs> no, but let. 
This is this is your field of expertise, isn't it? Stroke angry things. It is. No, we should be oh, fine. Well, let's, uh, let's very let's carefully go. creep around, shall we? Litrix follows you quietly, but cursing under his breath. In in draconic. I can just see bubbles behind me. No. I, I'm just gonna keep going forward, like, guess, yep. like, stop me once you, I yep. hit a point where you're like, oh no, you would notice this thing. I, I will yell at you once there is anything. Right now, it's, you know, surprisingly calm and chill and relaxed. Is it quiet? You're really quiet. Um, actually, where you are right now, you can hear soft chanting it's coming from in here. Hmm. You hear that? I like nod and just sort of like keep quiet. It's a very, very beautiful set of double doors. Um, they have um a, a there's a beautiful picture carved in of a well beautiful. It's. Beautiful as in it's great worksmanship, it's less beautiful as in it depicts um, the Sahagwin um, goddess uh, ripping um, a, a lizard folk apart with her bare hands. Hmm. Pleasant. Lovely. Shall we murder? This is probably where the priestess is, right? Uh, is there any sort of indication as to how many people might be behind those doors chanting? Ah, uh, give me a perception check. See if you can make out distinct voices. No, it's loading up the shoot. Perception. All right. Um. You would guess around four to six. You're not entirely sure. Maybe it's best to come back. Get more of a, a scope of the layout before we decide to make any hasty decisions, yeah? I think so. I'm sure they'll be charging for a while. Like a bunch of hallways. It's a lot of doors. There's a lot of doors. Um, hold on, hold on. Oh. Um, you can... Uh, hear talking coming from down here. It is just one voice and it's very commanding. Ooh. I will sneak a peek as right, quietly as I can. You sneak a peek and you see one pretty big Sahagwin like with his back turned to you. Um, addressing several um, Sahagwin soldiers that are standing attention in front of him. And he's yelling something at them. Yep. And occasionally they all um, respond. Do I get an idea as to how many Sahagwin are with him in there? Um, a lot. <laughs> Uh, by what you can away. see, yeah, like around 30, maybe. Definitely backing away. <laughs> and uh, we'll investigate up here. <laughs> Alright. Where's Ledrick? Uh, sorry. Um, he's with you. He's just... Yeah. No, just I was looking at other stuff. Yeah, no, he's Making sure he's, he's not... Just going no, he's not swimming No, no, he's... Yeah. He is stairs. behaving. 
it's costing him, but he's behaving. <laughs> uh, yeah, stairs Do leading these down. Stairs... Oh, okay, they're going down. Leading further down. Yeah. Um, uh, oh, there's something in here. Yes, there is a lot of sharks just swimming and chilling. And this seems to be their shark pin. And they haven't seen us. Uh, they they have seen you, but they don't pay you any attention. They are just cool. All right, relax. <laughs> Seems they've been fed already. Man, if only you had a certain trident right now. Yep. Yep. Huh? Yep. All right. Um, <laughs> slow down a bit, please. Yep. <clears throat> Uh, the corridor leads to a great hall. It's floor tiled in black, the walls in coral pink, and the ceiling in white. Black tiled pillars are regularly placed in a line slightly south of the east-west axis. To the north of the pillars, long tables have been placed end to end, with benches to either side. At the midpoint of the north wall, an archway opens onto a passage. This ornate archway is decorated with elegant black and gold designs, evocative of waves and monstrous sea creatures. And you again can hear talking coming from here. What is this here? This here? Mm hmm. Um, as you swim closer, uh, Litrix can actually tell you a bit about it. Um, a semicircular niche has been hollowed into the center of the south wall. The floor of the niche sits seven feet off the ground. On the shelf formed there stands a large carved stone head visibly battered and disfigured. The features can still be recognized as those of a lizard folk. The head is about twice as large as life size. And um, Litrix sees this and he like lets out a growl. And he says, this, this will used to be our greatest treasure. It was a statue of Simwanya, our goddess. And they've done this to it. I'll nod and um, swim up over to here and just want to check to see what I can see and hear in this room. Um, you hear discussion, like you just hear normal talking going on. Does it sound like there's a large number in there or? Um, no, um, there is only three people talking right now to begin with. There are only three vo um, voices you can make out. Turn to the others and I'll, like, indicate my sword and just sort of like, shall we? <laughs> <laughs> I'm just gonna take an arrow out of my bow and just give him a nod. <laughs> Alright, and charge in and start slashing. Okay, roll initiative. How do arrows work underwater? Maybe. Oh no, what have um, we done? Arrows, uh, arrows only work um, uh, short range. They don't have their long range. Oh, I, that's fine. Plenty of range. Wait, that's more than three? Well, only, I said only three of them were talking, all right? Ah, uh, yeah, fair enough. I'll do it now. <laughs> 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 um. Oh boy, here we go. Okay. I I just need to find some things and some character sheets. I'll be with you in a second. <laughs> uh, what are you? You at that? I'm for some holy fire, I think. <laughs> oh, glorious. Yes. This is perfect. Let's be glad that magic fire works in the water. Uh, oh, and I need the sharkies. Tiny little. Uh, 
Yeah, the armor chalks. I love them. Oh, so, so. All right. All right. Um. Oh, for fuck's sake. Let's see. Those are some good initiative rolls. Not nice for me. <laughs> <laughs> right. Let us have some initiative rolls here. I feel like I should have taken magic initiative to get shield. That's what I'm feeling. <laughs> Why did I get resilience and constitution when I could have got shield? Well, on the plus side, you have very much surprised them. So that's Excellent. nice. Um, Alright, let me read you a bit of a description first, though. <clears throat> At the end of a short stretch of corridor, another archway opens into a larger area. Here, the floor is tiled indigo and the walls dark blue. On the north side, a massive, ornately carved throne rises from a pale blue dais. Pale blue marble pillars stand to the east and west. The dais is of the same pale blue marble while the throne is black coral. The ceiling is tiled in pale blue. On the throne sits an oversized Tahagwin. This creature has four arms. In his right upper hand, he holds a large trident. His two lower hands grip the arms of the throne. Floating next to the throne, on the creature's right hand side, is an adult female Sahagwin holding a long staff tipped with a jumble of shark, teeth, shark jaws and teeth. In front of the throne and at the foot of the dais, three adult Sahagwin float with their backs to you. Two float with bodies held rigid while the third pleads before the throne. And as you can see, there are two sharks in coral plate armor circling above the throne as well. All right. Well, um, he is surprised. He did not expect to have someone storm in while he deals with politics. So he is going to unsurprise himself. The shell shark is going to unsurprise himself. Stolgeg! What's the plan, buddy? There Your isn't rage. much of a plan. <laughs> I have already enraged. I did that in preparation. All right. So Sounds that's good. the bonus action. <laughs> uh, and we said it was the minimum range on throwing stuff. Didn't we? Yes. They're pretty, oh. pretty useless above that. Long range just isn't really. Thank God I can move a bit closer. Throwing a javelin at the blue guy on the right. Alright, throw your javelin. Um, but it just glances off his coral armor. Does not do injure him. Fucking do it again. And it goes wide. It's it's you're not quite used to throwing stuff underwater. It's a bit difficult, you know. I'm scared. <laughs> Nervous. It's got sweaty palms. Janice, <laughs> yes, it's your sweaty palms. <laughs> um, what what is the height from floor to ceiling? Um, height from floor to ceiling is. Hang on. Hang on. Ugh. Who's there, somewhere else. Ten seconds. Uh, thirty feet high. Well, never mind then. All right, <laughs> that sucks. <laughs> <laughs> All 
Um, I am going to cast Hunter's Mark on 